In this video, we are going to be installing an operating system called as Kali Linux. And that is the operating system that we are going to be using to hack Wi-Fi and to crack Wi-Fi passwords. So let's actually see how to install Kali Linux. So tap on Google Chrome. So tap on Google Chrome or any of your favorite browser and type in Kali Linux download. So Kali Linux download. Enter. Now tap on the first link. So tap on the first link. Now in the last video, I've told you that we're going to be installing Kali Linux with the help of VirtualBox, right? So let me actually search for that file. So let me just scroll down and find for that particular file. And there you go. So Kali Linux 64 bit virtual box and Kali Linux 32 bit virtual box. If you're using a 64 bit computer, you're going to be tapping on this particular link. And if you're using a 32 bit computer, you're going to be tapping on this particular link. As I'm using a 64 bit computer, I'm going to be tapping on this particular link. So tap on this particular link. And now all you need to do is just scroll down and find for that particular file that you need to download. And there you go, Kali Linux virtual box images. So tap on this particular menu. And now tap on this particular link that is Kali Linux virtual box 64 bit. If you're using a 32 bit computer, tap on this particular one. As I'm using 64 bit computer, I'm going to be tapping on this particular link. And guys, make sure that you're downloading Kali Linux for VirtualBox, this particular one. In the last video, we have installed VirtualBox. And with the help of VirtualBox, we're going to be installing Kali Linux operating system. So make sure that you are installing this particular Kali Linux VirtualBox images and not Hyper-V or VMware images. We're going to be installing Kali Linux with the help of VirtualBox. Got it? Cool. So tap on this particular link. And if you're using 32 bit computer, tap on this particular one. Don't forget. So now just tap on this particular one. And now the download has started. As you can see, it's almost 3.2 GB. So what I did is I already downloaded this file yesterday. So let me just cancel this and show you that particular file. So let me just close this window. So that particular downloaded file I've saved in this particular folder. So now, this is that particular file that I downloaded yesterday. So to install Kali Linux, all you need to do is double tap on this particular file. So just double tap on it. And now as you can see, the virtual box has opened. So now all you need to do is tap on import. And you can see that the Kali Linux operating system is being imported into this particular virtual box. So wait for the process to complete and I'll come back to you after the process is done. So now that the process is complete, we can start our Kali Linux virtual machine. So to do that, all you need to do is tap on this particular Kali Linux. So tap on it and now tap on this start button. So tap on this green start button. So to start your Kali Linux virtual machine. So tap on it. and we got an error so let me just see what is that error so tap on this particular one and as you can see a possible reason for this error is missing extension pack now if you got the same error just follow the steps that i'm about to do now so let's just say okay and let me just close this and let me just go back to google chrome so now type in virtual box so virtual box extension pack so extension pack enter so tap on the first link just scroll down and here you can see that virtualbox 5.2.12 oracle vm virtualbox extension pack so now all you need to do is tap on this particular link that is all supported platforms so just tap on it And you can see that the virtual box extension pack is being downloaded. So let us just wait till it gets downloaded. So now the download is complete and this is that particular file that is virtual box extension pack. Now all you need to do is just double tap on that particular file. That's it. So double tap on it. And tap on upgrade. 
so upgrade and tap on I agree and let me just type in my password enter and that's it so tap on ok so now let us just start our Kali Linux virtual machine again and see if that works now or not so select this particular one and tap on this green button that is start button so tap on start And there you go, we successfully started our Kali Linux virtual machine and it's working. So now let me just, you know, make this a full screen. So full screen switch. So the username is root, that is R-O-O-T. So R-O-O-T. So tap on next and the password is reverse of root, that is T-O-O-R. So T-O-O-R and tap on sign in. And there you go. This is Kali Linux operating system and this is the operating system that we'll be using to hack Wi-Fi and to crack Wi-Fi passwords. So guys, this is how you install Kali Linux with the help of VirtualBox. See you in the next video.